Hey guys, how are you? It's been a while. I hope everybody is doing great. Me and Colson are going to do a video with you guys today, a quick yard sale haul. And it's also going to show you the next potential giveaway when I hit 110 subscribers. So stick around for that. I can't eat my heart. So let's get right into it. I am a die hard yard sailor. Like, no kidding. I go Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, and I will go all day long. And that is where I get the majority of my kids' clothing and a lot of my household items, like a lot of my decor. When you can get it for a dollar or 50 cents, why not? So I have been going to yard sales since I was like 18, and like my apartments when I was younger were decorated fully from yard sales, and my house now is decorated with yard sales. So I just, I'm in love with them and I wanted to share with you some of the stuff I got. And there is also, like I said, something that I found that I think is going to be in my next giveaway. I need you guys to comment below and tell me if you're interested in it though, because I don't want to give away something that nobody likes, but I really think you're going to like it. So let's get right into it. I found this Tommy Hilfiger sweater. And as you can see, that was only a dollar. One dollar. So this is like a navy blue. Tommy Hilfiger is expensive. It's, you know, around 30 bucks, even if you get it at like Marshalls or Ross or whatever. So that was one. The second sweater I got, this was all from the same yard sale. This is Banana Republic. Again, how much was that? That was $1.50. But it's so thick and so warm. And, oh, I just love it. I can't wait to wear it. And the buttons are really pretty. So that was $1.50. Um, I got a green sweater, and this was Talbot. That, again, is very pricey, and I paid 50 cents for that. The sweater I'm wearing, I forget who this is, but this was only 50 cents at the yard sale. Most of my clothes are from yard sales. The majority of my clothes, I don't ever really, uh, they're from yard sales and Goodwill. Okay, so this one's really cute, button-down cardigan for 50 cents. It has the three-quarter sweaters. I mean, three quarter sleeves. Oh my goodness. Okay, and then one other sweater I got. This is Banana Republic. Again, a button down cardigan. And how much was that one? That one is a dollar. So right there, I just got four, five new sweaters for less than like one, two, three, four, five bucks. I mean, you can't beat that. I always buy my, uh, when I knew I was pregnant with Colson and actually the last three of my babies, I went to yard sales. I, you know, your first baby, you always go and buy like brand new stuff at, you know, Toys R, Babies R Us and Walmart or whatever. But I learned very quickly after the first one that you don't need to buy brand new stuff. So all of his stuff was definitely from yard sales. I spent less than $100 on his swing, on his playpen. I got his playpen for $4.95 and it was like brand new at Goodwill. Um, I found his swing for free. This high chair that he's in was a dollar at the yard sales. I just, oh, it's wonderful. Got a bunch of new socks for Colston for 50 cents. So there's a ton of socks in there. I found, um, I found a pair of shoes. These are Bob's. I don't know if you guys know the brand Bob's, but they're they're kind of expensive. And those were only 50 cents. And they're perfect because they're my size and they're so cute. And they're going to be cute with jeans or shorts in the summer. I found my son Caden a brand new, well, brand new to him, Adidas jacket. And this was $4. Spring is coming up. You can see that. Navy blue Adidas jacket. Oh crap, I think this might be reversible. I haven't even unzipped it. Oh my, check that out. Oh, I think it's reversible. Oh, that's even better yet. Okay, so I got him a $4 reversible Adidas jacket. And I got myself another pair of shoes, and these are like brand new. These, I am so excited about these. These are Vans. I don't ever buy myself like expensive brand new shoes. These are probably $40 or $50 in the store. And I know because I buy my daughter a ton of these, but these were only $2. And they're like brand new. That is definitely a score for me. Okay, so I found, this is what I wanted to show you guys for the possible, oh and then I got this cute little crop, Abercrombie and Fitch crop top, crop sweater. 
and that one was a dollar. That's really cute. I should put that on now. Okay, this is the exciting part. This is what I think is going to be in my next giveaway, but I need you guys to let me know if you are interested in it and if you would even like it. So, sometimes I get really, really lucky at yard sales, and I don't know why people give their stuff away for so, so cheap, but this is like a brand new Beer Bradley zip around wallet. The zipper works perfect. There's slots inside for your for your cards, for your ID. There is a, a, a slot for your change. And I'm telling you, it's like, it's not dirty. It's great. It has the Vera Bradley tags and I only paid 50 cents for it. Can you believe that? So, I think this should go in one of my giveaways. Vera Bradley is expensive. I posted a link the other day um, on my Instagram about how there was a sale on Vera Bradley and you know even if you did the sale you'd probably get a wallet like this for about 13 bucks maybe but now you have an opportunity to get one free from me if you like it so comment down below and let me know uh oh hold on a second uh oh here you go okay um but that's not where it ends to go with the Vera Bradley I got this at a yard sale as well and this was only one dollar and this thing is amazing look at the Vera Bradley large tote this is in like absolute perfect condition look at the corners there's nothing wrong with the corners nothing wrong with the bottom look it's in it's like pristine condition and I paid a dollar for this holy cow okay and then it zips at the top it is so clean I I don't know if you guys can see. It is so clean on the inside. It is perfect and it's kind of large. Let me show you guys how large it is. So it's like a large tote. Let me get this out of the way. But look how pretty it is. They're not gonna be a set and they're not gonna match, but hey, it's still a really nice gift. You can um, keep it for yourself, give it away as a gift, but I paid $1.50 for this set. And I cannot believe it. And I think it would be great to give away to one of you guys. There's even pockets on the side. I mean, I guess you could use it as a diaper bag if any of you have small kids. Or a beach tote or whatever. A yard sale tote when you go to yard sales. If you go like me. So, oh, and then there's one last thing that's probably going to be in the giveaway. Now, where did it go? I always, I don't know if you guys hear me talk about how I always find... All my jewelry usually comes from yard sales, and I pay 50 cents, a dollar, sometimes 10 cents for them. So, this was found at a different yard sale, but it literally has the tags, and it's from Chico's. Okay, $28, and it's like a three-chain link bracelet. Um, it's got like a little bit of stretch, but I have really small wrists, so you can see what it would you know, you can kind of determine how it would be on your wrist. So pretty. I paid a quarter for this. 25 whopping cents for a $28 bracelet. That I'm going to give to you guys. That's going to be in the giveaway too. So we got the large tote. We got the Vera Bradley wallet, zip around wallet. And then I'm going to throw in some jewelry, more jewelry. Guys, I'm telling you, yard sale season is upon me, and I find some of the most amazing things, and I can't wait to see what I find to give away to all of you. I want to make sure that the the straps on this are, like, perfect. I would hate to give something away that I, I didn't see a flaw, but honestly, this is flawless. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, my gosh. I'm guessing this was probably around $50 brand new. I'm just guessing, and I'm just estimating from what I saw. Oh, yeah. I'm just estimating what I saw on the website the other day from the Vera Bradley sale. But So, comment below if you are interested in this as a giveaway. So, the tote, the wallet, and the bracelet. And I think that's going to be when I hit, like, 110 subscribers. I'm kind of almost there, but... Um, I think it's better sometimes than makeup all the time. But, you know, and if you are new to my channel, every month I do a boxy charm giveaway um, with my Ipsy as well. And then I just kind of like to throw some other giveaways in the mix throughout the month or whenever I come across some awesome stuff. So, 
that's it. That was my quick video today. I just wanted to hop on because I haven't been on for a while and I was so excited to share this with you. One dollar! Fifty cents! Guys, oh my gosh, I'm so in love. There's only one yard sale this weekend, so I'm kind of bummed out, so I may have to go to Goodwill to see what I can find. Because I'm just, I'm like yearning to go and spend some money. I don't know. I don't know. I have a shopping problem. But I feel it's justified if I'm only going and spending like a dollar on an item or 50 cents on an item. Then I can have a shopping problem. So anyway, okay, that's it. That's my short video for today. Um, comment below to let me know if you are interested in these items as a next giveaway when I hit 110 subscribers, which is hopefully soon. Thank you guys all for watching. Thank you all for my new subscribers. Thank you all for who have been subscribed. We love you. No, we love you, Colston. Say hi, Colston. Thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I will be back with another video sometime later this week. Thank you.